A very good afternoon everybody, Austin back with another video. So in today's video I'm just going to talk about my miniature hose reel that I made. I often work on sites where I cannot get a van close enough to the area of where I'm working. It doesn't seem sensible to unreal 100 plus metres of hose around objects, buildings and vehicles to get to the windows in question. So I sometimes work with my Unger hydropower kit direct from mains water fed by the means of a hose pipe or either my pump trolley, a pole and 25 litres of water at a time per drum on the trolley. So I made this little hose reel just to complement the system that I'm using. It gives me extra reach, makes it a lot easier to work around the site. but. Just talk a bit more about the hose reel. I did feature it in a previous video. I've had a few people message me via Facebook about the reel in question. As you can see, I made it myself. It previously was a Brennan style, I believe it's pronounced, German 30 meter extension reel. So electrical extension reel. It was full of cable, which was burnt out. So someone had overloaded it. But the overall condition of the hose reel itself was fantastic and a great donor for my project. Also, it's good to recycle and reuse as and where you can, within reason. So what I've done, <clears throat> I've taken out the twin 13 amp socket front plate off the front here. I found a piece of gray plastic in an old kitchen dustbin, which was very pliable. I cut it into a circle and I've mounted it to the center of the hose reel. I've got 30 meters of yellow flexible PU hose, um, rectus 21 fitting on the end with an O-clip and then some heat shrink as well just to protect that join and to give it a bit of rigidity and abrasion resistance. A protector ball which was complements of St John's Ambulance, I believe it was a stress ball but it works perfectly, sits on the end, protects the fitting when it's been reeled up and drags around the ground. I've got the original extension reel retainer clip that clips onto the side wall of the reel. So talking a bit more about the fittings and the hardware in question. So the fittings that I've used are a three quarter inch hose lock style plunk clip male tap adapter where you'd normally fit on your outside tap. That then goes onto a brass bushing which is a three quarter inch outer with a half inch inner diameter. All these sizes are in metric. Um, British metric BSP sizing and then on the inside of this plate there is a half inch brass nipple which is a male threaded tube basically and then on the back of that there is a half inch hose tail adapter which screws onto the back of the nipple with a four millimeter barb fitting and then an o-ring clip to keep the hose on the back of it very easy to make, all of these fittings, they are brass, they are all obtained from Tool Station here in the UK, which is a hardware and tool shop. In total, the hose, the fittings, probably cost me no more than £25. The hose reel, second hand, recycled, reused, works perfectly, but it's 30 metres of additional hose to complement the pole hose on the water fed pole brush but it works very well, 30 meter, quickly grab and go, very lightweight, but there we go. If you like the video and you have any questions, feel free to leave them below in the comments. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, hit the bell icon for more updates and notifications as and when I post a video. And if you'd like to subscribe, that would make my day. Thank you very much. See you soon. Bye bye.